the, the advances in computing technology are they're, they're not, I think, well understood widely. There is a sense, perhaps, that all the big changes to society have happened already, and that's certainly not true. We're going to see some radical things. Um, already some, some very senior people have been expressing fears about what might happen when machine intelligence surpasses human intelligence, and that's something that I would hope to be talking about later in the series. But there are, are other issues about the way that computing is, is changing society. So although I wouldn't say that we were at a crossroads, there are certainly a, a variety of paths ahead that we should perhaps be choosing between in a conscious way rather than, than just wandering aimlessly down the first one that comes to hand. Also, there is a, a risk that we face a tipping point, particularly in the way in which big data is leading to people's personal data being processed both by large commercial corporations and by governments, which is causing a growing concern across the population. Uh, we're seeing societal and demographic shifts in the way that, that different groups of people respond to that, and that's a process that will continue. I do wonder whether we might reach a tipping point where some release of private information causes a major change in behaviour towards either large corporations or towards people's willingness to give personal information in circumstances where society really needs, needs them to do so.